Hello everyone, Ignite for welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. Today we will be taking on World 2, Floor 2, whatever. But just a quick note, well besides the fact that, uh, if you see this little Mickey Mouse symbol, let's just put my mouse over there, uh, that means that you are, uh, no, I shouldn't have done it, that you are done with that section. So premium codes spell premium codes. I don't use them because I think they're worth more, but mainly it's because they kind of don't really help because you can't use them again for the rest of the battle. So I try to avoid getting them as much as I can. And another side note, I haven't played this game in like three, in like, uh, how many months was it since the first world came up? Yeah. This is June 29th, I'm just recording it. Well, Sora, did you enjoy your mem- beating your memories? It was good to see everyone again. But why show me an illusion? What do you want from me? It depends on what you want, have to give. Boo. What do you want? Um, I got bored with, with what you, what with you, hogging hero, the hero, fuck, I'm bad at this right now. Perhaps you would like to test him. Perhaps I would. Looks like my, it's my turn now, keep the master. My name's Axel. Committed to memory. Um, sure. Good, you learned quick. So sore. Now that one a first name basis. Don't go dying on me. So this is the next boss, Axel. He's part of the organization 13, actually. I have their own. Open. I have the page open to the next. Well, because I completely forgot about the. I'm sorry, I drew a blank. So I just want to reopen my page back to. There's a boss, it. X. Oh, Organization 13. He appeared in Kingdom Hearts 2. Uh, not. Hey. Kind of both by sleep. Ah, oh, that was a dick spot where he wasn't used that. Organization 13, they kind of like to bounce around a lot. Firewall, you just uh, dodge roll through. Bear roll. You want to do a bear roll through and not use... Well, we don't even have any fire element hurts yet, douche. Let's do this. Oh wow, another dog. Just don't use fire on him. Fire heals him. Ice does good damage. And let's end this with magic. Okay, and thank you, dead. Not that hard of boss. Second boss. I also never did. 7 EXP, really. And we obtained world cards. More cards. And a card. It was like the card mate. Used to make twat. Drive like town. Traverse town. And then we need to use these to go on. Correct. I'm trying to think for a voice for him. And foul. After that, after an introduction like that, you don't just you don't think I just give up like a ghost. You don't stand a ghost of a chance. <laughs> so you were just testing our strength. Congratulations, Sora, you passed. You're ready to take on Castle Oblivion. Follow your memories, trust what you remember, seek what you forget. And you will find someone very special. You mean Riku and the King? Well, I don't know. You'll just have to give some more thought to who's most important to you. 
one of our most precious memories lie in the depths of our heart, out of reach. But you find your sword. Where? How? Light within the darkness. You've lost sight of it, Sora. You've forgotten. Forgetting. Light? I don't understand. Were you like a hint? What, Sora? No, I'd like to figure out for myself. Then you get in my way. He won't. We won't let him. That's my kind of answer. Just what I expect from a Keyblade Master. But be forewarned. When your sleeping memories awaken, you may lo no longer be you. Okay, that was a sprite earlier in the emulator, how we could see his feet. And if this basically is saying if we go up when next time we go back to Travis Town down there, it will be all reset. That's why I say if you're gonna clear out all your floors all your rooms I mean before you go up to another floor. Something wrong, Jiminy? What Axel said has been bothered I me. Mean, what could you have meant by? You may not, no longer be you. Come on, how can I be anyone besides me? I know, I know. Still, it always pays to be careful. Yeah, just about anything could happen here in Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion. Oblivion. Exactly. Uh, a blast of me, Oh, but there we am! Right, what you said? Well, we'll be fine. Whatever they're cooking up, together we can handle it. Hey, remember that other castle we explored together? With all the contraptions? When was that? Traps and I don't remember any castle like that. What was it called? Ghost. What was it again? Holla, holla. I feel good. Oh, for Pete's sake. You sure you didn't make it up? I don't think so. Basic. Okay, that is a later world in the world from Kingdom Hearts 1 to any kind of birth by sleep. But anyway, these are the worlds that we have unlocked. We have Agrippa, I want to go this, Olympus Coliseum, Wonderland, Monstro, and, and Halloween Town. I will be tackling in these in the order that it is supposed to be like how it is programmed out, like written out. So it will, like how the guidebook says how the codes are given to us. So I will be doing Agrabah, Olympus Coliseum, Wonder Then Monster, then Halloween Town. So that's the order we'll always be going in, all the way, or what, all the way around clockwise. But anyway, without further ado, let's enter Agrabah. Look, Dora, someone's in trouble. We better do something. Looks like he could use some help. I can't do a voice for him. Okay. Thanks, I thought I was done for. Why do you use voices? Oh well. And actually, we're doing. I'm probably going to do the analysis of the enemies after or before this fight, I don't know. I should have added in fire into my forehead. Oh wait, I don't have any. I didn't have enough 
stuff, I don't think. Oh yes, I have... I think we've seen those green knock turns before. I mean, not green knock turns, green requiem before. But if not, we'll be figuring out them after. Uh, what I say... We still have level 1, level 2, and what's that? So level 3, 9 is this. And more. They just keep coming! Guess we'd better make. Guess we'd better see if that's in the stream. Magic them! My first wish! Get rid of the heartless! You got it! Did someone say worse? Stand back, kids! Genie of the lamp coming through! Ain't nothing we can't. Ain't nothing I can make right as rain off a hat rain. But enough dry jokes. Bumch! One heart that's disappearing and coming right up. Gold! Why didn't you call him in the first place? It's not that simple, you see. I could've... I couldn't've said it better myself, but I will anyway. Strictly limited three wishes per master. No wishing for more wishes. You got two wishes left, but I use them carefully. I've got to get back to the tower somehow, but with all these hurt this. Hey Soil, we're heading that way too. Why don't we go with the Aladdin? Sounds like a plan. That would be great, thanks a lot guys. We don't know each other, he never told us the name, his name. And welcome to Agrabah. Okay, and enemies for this world, um, first note of advice, if you, uh, not advice, but if you notice that my audio quality is different than it is in the rest of this video, it's because I'm, this is, like, way, because I recorded the video, like, a while back, and then I'm just redoing, I'm just doing this audio finally with a new laptop, desktop, and my can set up for how I normally record my audio, so you'll probably notice the little difference, I'm oh, sorry about that. But yes, first new enemy of this world is the Air Soldier. It's a flying soldier that hovers above the battlefield, dropping down on the opponent, and it has no elements, so hey, there you go. You don't have to worry about weapon uh, on the field. And it's actually one of the very good enemy cards. It's either kidding me. I don't really know if I pass the last part of that right. Please just tell me if I didn't. Uh, but you get to reload in motion, like you can still be running around and reloading. And I think I'll be getting that by the end of the world, and then you may not be sticking with the form if I did. Remember, you still have a few other chances to get to get them if we didn't. And then the next is the first of the world specific for this. These world specific characters include a few of them have throughout the world. There's two in this, two in another, and then there's like another what? One, two, three, four, five, maybe? Six? I think it's about six of those worlds. I think there's about six total worlds because we've heard this sometimes, say. So. Yes, this is a bandit. It's unique. Yeah, it's unique to the world of Agrippa. And it's familiar. It's similar to the standard soldier. It's basically a soldier, but it's a bandit. And so, its enemy card is the combo finish. Uh, makes normal enemy makes any normal attack. Sorry, as strong as a finishing blow in that for one without. I'm extremely fast because I can. And then we have the bell spider. Actually, a bell spider is a fierce spider that looks eerily like normal bells. When you strike one, it and come when you strike a barrel, it could actually be a barrel spider and it will come to life and attack. They, if you want the code, it's kind of difficult, or if you want any code, it's kind of difficult. But you need strong codes, they only use fours, and they give you the quick reload enemy code. If you reload codes instantly, that's for three reloads. <clears throat> and then next is another world specific code 
This is the Fat Bandit, as I flip my book. Uh, the Fat Bandit. It's similar to the Lord's body, which I don't think we've seen yet. Maybe we have. Uh, I don't think so. But you can only attack them from behind. They're defended everywhere else in the body. Yeah, we haven't yet. And the unique the wall of Agrabah. You can only hit them from behind because the fat outer front part is defended. There, as I said, the Lord's body is a it's another form of this, but there's also one other form that we'll be seeing in the game. I kind of heard I heard this because they'll block they'll go at any of your hits in the front. Except for magic. So magic is always good to use against them. They absorb physical attacks to the front. And anyway, his enemy could is basic attacks. It increases damage when dragging enemies from behind and that's for true those. So yeah, he kinda gives you his own weakness. Next is the green requiem. Small Next is the Green Requiem. Small floating shadows dressed in green cloaks that specialize in cure magic. But basically like the other uh rec like the yellow knock turn which I haven't I mean yellow op opera or something. I hope you get that the uh next actually. Of uh, the red knock turn in the blue rust Rhapsody. The, but this one cannot be. If you hit it by any magic attacks, it will heal. And it will also heal other enemies. So it's a good idea to take that out first. And its enemy code is a cure boost. It increases the strength of cure abilities. That's for one reload. And then next is the final of the new hurt this for this world. There's one more hurt this which is in this world. But I. But we'll get to that in a second. It's the yellow off. Uh, small floating hurt this just in. And it's the yellow off. Uh, small floating shadows dressed in yellow cloaks this time. Specialized in lightning based magic. And so it's like all the other guys. Just don't hit them with thunder, which we don't have at this point in time. But we will be in, in a few floors. Yeah. So, you don't really have to worry about this one. And it gives you thunder boost, which, like other things, boosts thunder. And still, because we don't have thunder, it's, like I said, it's not that useful. And the last hurt this first floor is a returning hurt. This is the shadow. So, I'm just going to leave that up for a second and get back to the game. Okay, so that should be enough time for me to. To figure out who was we got for keep late of this wall right off the bat. Uh, fat bandit sounds like you. These It's kind of interesting the wall specific hurt this. Except for when you're trying except whenever you want to try to get off the enemy hoods, then it's kind of a pain. That. I didn't need healing. Stalled, you suck at that. I'm definitely gonna do some level grinding off camera. Ooh, black groom. So this is a black. So this is a black fungus. So if you're wondering why it just shows a big black. You could on the side where the worlds are. It's because we can find them anywhere. That's also why they up all the worlds, except for the one that no one can be found in. But they are the opposite of the white mushroom, and they help, which we'll also begin to once we see a white room could, because they can also only be found in white rooms. These creatures have a good fight, and rewards are yours if you manage to defeat them. The enemy card is random flush, and it gives you a random enemy card, but only that's for one reload. So it can be good, it depends really what you, like, get. Like, you can get any enemy card in the game, you don't have to have it. Like, I've got, before, from using it, the enemy card ability from the fight, from, like, the second half boss. Like, um, so... Now from like a boss in later worlds or whatnot, so it can be useful actually. 
and so yes, they are also very powerful and can lock you and you just can hit and they also have a good, they're not that powerful at this level, but yeah, they get, they can just spam you and there's two found, like there's two in the overworld and then they can be up to I think four in the battle at once. But that's it, so I'm just going to let you get back to the game. Goodbye. Yeah, that should have been good enough time for to explain the flag room. And the hurt does not come in it. I'm just giving myself a dota work after this, after filming this episode. Yeah, I do that post production. Why didn't I put the fire chip in? Fire chip. I spent way too much Mega Man. I haven't played any Mega Man in a month. A few months anyway. Actually like a month. And there's a that in. So another uh, another worlds. Other worlds give you sometimes other friends that you get. In this world, your friend just have your extra friend just happens to be that in. You can only have up to three friends, like in any Kingdom Hearts game, there's gonna be about three friends a wall maximum. Let's add in those cards before I forget. Three Wishers, the keyblade of this world. Every world has a keyblade. It's kinda your job to find them. Ooh, I have an eight. That could be be useful in the future. And let's just throw in that because I can. Now go back to my folders. You there, you there. And just toss you down there somewhere. Okay, that's Kingdom Key. There we go. Okay, I had to look at my map for a second to figure out where we are. And what we're doing where we want to go. Wait, this is key to the beginning. Key of beginnings. So we want to use a green code, which I only have one of, surprisingly. And you. I thought Genie wasn't a vamp. Now why can't. Oh, so why are you going to the palace of that in? This magic. There, I found Cave Wonders. <clears throat> I need to get away, get to the palace right away. I'm lucky I made it to back to Agrabah in one piece. The cave was crawling with her at this. Wasn't anyone else to help you out? I know how you feel, Master. I've been living in happiness for 2,000 years, and what help do I get? I keep dreaming someone will get me push me out of this gate, but go figure the odds on that. Well, how about I use my third wish to set you free? Those... Those my pont hey ears save me, master. Sorry, I had to do it in that accent. You'd be willing to do that to me? I'm not pulling my leg. My tip... Top knot. No. Now, what about you? I promise, Genie. Anyway, there's only one thing I really want. Well, well, we'll just have to do something about that. Al, can I call you Al? But, so what will that be? Fame, fortune? I heard of luxury of camels. Call, to call you. I heard of luxury camels. Call, to call you. Oh, wow, I'm doing bad with this today. I'm sorry, folks. Well, there's a girl named Jasmine. She's Princess of Agrippa. And that's a problem. It's hard for a guy like me to use a chance to see her. That's how it all started. Just for the what royal vis vizier and <laughs> said, You'd help me meet Jasmine. Sounds like your wish should be you can see Jasmine anytime you want, huh? Well, I got to pack the package for you. You'll not only meet the lady, you'll go in style. As Prince Ali! How about 
the sound of that, Al. Prince Ali. Da 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 da. Ali the Balboa. Me a prince? Can you really do that? Not. And I'll go about one minute. In an Agrabah minute, wow. What's wrong with me today with words? I guess that seems word true after all, so uh, let's look at the palace. And we have Key of Guidance. Who wants to bet that problems are going to occur? And I get into more fights. This is what I'm looking at my thing. Two, three hearts we haven't seen yet that can be seen in this world. None of them are world specific hearts, these are the only two. Aladdin. I want to use because he has piercing and doesn't get affected by that. Just to kill the fat bandit quickly. Hey, that worked out nicely. And 30 some odd EXP, that's... no 25. Ah, bloody hell. It doesn't really matter. Ads... It's just... Ads time, especially since I haven't played this in a while and I'm not looking forward to the next... world. Because... I don't know, next world I just always have a problem. Wow, that worked out nicely. Anyway, level up. 10 and EXP. Health. Yeah, we're gonna increase our EXP. That's smart. Uh, wait for me. I find it funny that we can't see any red nocturnes in this world, but we can still see them on the map screen. Uh, you know what? Proof of concept, I'll use my black room one here just to show off because. Nice. I do suggest take. <laughs> no, seriously, they can get you in a pattern where you will have no power but just to. Hey, good. Yeah, get out of your goods. Thank you. No fun. Uh, they can seriously just get in the routine of paralyzing you all the time. It is annoying. <laughs> oh wait, I have a, I have an enemy card in here. Which hmm. F? Oh, there we go. Yes. Come on. Come on. I know I don't have a time limit, but I don't want to be spending a whole video like of on time on this. Thank you and uh, compound. I always say use compound in worlds because they are useful. I want to get that. Hey, thank you for cooperating. Uh, Come on, just keep out. No, see what? See, they can just. Three in a row. They can seriously just lock into a pattern sometimes where they will do nothing but the freaking paralyzing. And you will be stuck there, being constantly paralyzed until they finally do something else. I think the longest that ever happened to me was. I don't even remember, it was a long, long time. Let's use calm down. Okay, this is a small floor. So do not sig So doing any fighting, mainly those 
as a community, there's four rooms where you can do stuff. This one, two, I'm hitting 20 buttons. One, two, three, four. This is the key to rewards, and this is the exit. So, yeah. There's not much rooms who have open floors of fighting and stuff. And what's their treasure? Ooh, gravity. That is nice. That is a magic card. But I'm not going to get into that one. I'm probably never going to use it. I want to go back. Because, actually, my exit. Oh, nice. Bill Spider. I want to keep pounding them with cards or else they will explode and you lose. And you can't get experience from them or. You also lose a chance of getting a card from them. Why did that I don't know? I don't know. Oh, we get the move over, not bad. You especially don't want the last one to explode. Or else then you can't really do anything. So fifteen. Uh, what do I have? High numbers of one, two, like three. In. Hey, look at that! Actually, I need to go do something over here. Back. Okay, well, I'm back. Who's that? Oh yeah, it's Jasmine. She needs our help. We're never making time. But I have no choice. Jamie! I wish for you to save Jasmine. Can do charge! <laughs> Jasmine! We're lucky she painted, but it looks like she's okay. But you know, you've only got one wish left. Not again, sorry Jeannie, but you're the only one who can't... Wait, this is your last wish, don't waste it. This time let us handle it. You know, I think here we see the final... And then, oh, okay, second last, I guess. Heard this that we have not seen in this world. I'm not going to really try to go all of the hood this, that can be seen in every world, but mainly if we haven't seen them yet, or if it's the first time. I mean, or if it's a floor but it's specific. Actually, it's just one hood this if we get a certain card, I do not want to be showing off because, yeah, and we didn't, well that's odd. And we get an ether, which will... It's like a potion, except it's for magic. See, you didn't need Genie that time. This time. Thanks, sir. So, I'm down to my last wish. What the? Wow, what's happening? Uh-oh, the lamp's gone. Hmm. It seems my plans have gone amiss. What? I was certain you'd waste your last wish. What with that poor da Jasmine in distress in the hood this to deal with? But no matter, I have the vamp. Is at least the vamp is mine. What are you planning? <clears throat> no, I saw you online. What are you doing? What are you doing? Wow, well, double put online. Why are you doing this, Jafar? I brought the lamp as, just as you asked. Don't you think you can fool me, boy. You are just going to use the lamp to win, Jasmine. But we can't have that now, can we? You see, I am the one who will marry Jasmine. You? I will marry Princess Jasmine. Nothing can stop me from becoming King of Agrabah. A uh, translation error, it's supposed to be Sultan. 
you are nothing but a pawn in my game, street rat. Genie, my first wish, deliver me, Jasmine. Genie, what are you doing? Sorry, all my hands are tied on this one. I gotta obey whoever has met something up. Precisely, farewell of that, you fool! Great, now we've lost Jasmine and the Vamp. Well, you feel... You can feel bad, but... Oh, it's some other time. If you don't pull yourself together, we'll never see Jasmine again. So you've lost the Vamp. So what? We can still save her on our own. Losing someone you care about is bad, but... Not as bad as never getting them back. Sora. You're right! I can't give up now, I'm going to save Jasmine. But Jafar's got the lamp! We can't just walk up to him and expect him to win! Maybe we can. I have an idea, listen up. And, hey cool, I got a free room out of it. Ooh, well that's one of them. Yellow, yellow Opa. Opa. Still, I think if I use any magic on them, that's what makes them feel. The mute magic. Well, that's making a little sense to my mind. I just want to get him out of the way so I have smaller targets to deal with. And I can hit them anywhere instead of having to be in front, behind. Oh, come on! There's literally two close to the wall to be hit. And just because of. Ah, oh, fuck it. Oh wow, I never even noticed what I used to break it with. And there goes that. And you know what, I think I'll just show off a Moogle room then. To, just to show it off, I could have used this room actually. And actually I will. I'm going to have to have a few final Moogle points. So I can actually buy stuff. So let's go. Yeah, yeah, this is where I'm supposed to be, but I don't care. I want to show off the Moogle room. So this is the shop room. This way we can get more cards. And I'm not going for that one because I thought I'm going to be sent out of the room. And every time you enter a Moogle room, you get a free pack of attack cards. Got seven. That's not bad. So we have the packs, and they do get better throughout the game. These are just basic packs. You can tell by the wrapping. So we have red is attack. So we have attack packs, magic packs, item packs, and mix packs. I'm probably gonna buy a few mix packs because these. It doesn't always come mixed, it's just random cards. Like that. We got actually a nice 8, eight Simba. Use this one fire. A few more use this cures. And I think I'll just go for a few. Wow, two platinum cards that I'm never gonna use. And I'm actually just gonna sell back. Six. Of course, I can buy two of those two magic packs. And thus I sell more cards. Which I am going to. Nine. Nine. Yeah, I can't buy. It. 
still here, we can still could like that. Sell everything up to seven. So, bunch of these. And I can sell Oh, just solar gravity because I'm never gonna show it off, really. Potions and ethers. And you can also sell enemy cards here. Be and not boss cards because you can't get those back. Uh, why do I have to get an 8 platinum here? That's a good card, except for the fact that. And then 7. Really? Really, game? of those because it's actually useful. And then that's going to get in my folder quickly. Uh, there's a two, three, three. I could probably just take that out. Actually, I'm trying to move around. I think that's actually it may be useful. But anyway, nine, seven, seven, seven. Cut myself short one attack card. Put that in, take out that seven, take out that. Probably just gonna put in that one. Put that. Put that. And I think I can just throw in a few more healing chips then. Healing! This is Mega Man! And sure, that's nice how my folder looks. And now let's head on to the boss. I've also been seeing network transmission, that's why I'm kind of like killing Chip. Yeah. So like that. And a red. I'll have three of these. Boss room ho! Ow. What's this? Is it that and giving up on this precious jasmine already? Well, I'm not going to waste my wish on likes of you three. I'll deal with you myself! And I didn't know! What? You genie sees him! Oh, forgive me! So for it, for What do you mean? <laughs> he means you just blew your second wish. You only have one left. Go ahead. Use it to win Jasmine's heart. You still have to deal with us. Oh, now I get it. Al, you are so clever. Well, well, cunning. The cunning of a rat. But unfortunately, you can't see beyond the cheese. Your little ploy changed nothing. I can crush you all once and for all. And Genie! And uh, no, and my Jasmine Mound! Genie! My last wish! Transform me into an all powerful Genie! <coughs> okay, his voice hurts. It's so hard. Tavor must be doing this. And it's Iago's one cameo in the whole game. You have... Jafar's weakness is the damn. You have... You have to hit the damn. That's kind of why I added in a bunch of... Why well, someone tried to make my full level. Oh, this is useless! Of course he decides to do that then. Thank you. You don't 
don't want to be in the middle because you can get stuck. Okay, so hitting him with ice does make the gimmick code appear. That is useful to know. Can I somehow stock up on gimmick codes? Gimmick! It's not that hard of a fight, really. It's more that's time consuming. Okay. It's time consuming because really you have to be up at the highest level just to be able to hit him. And sometimes this happens. Thankfully, a jump can more like believe <laughs> not. Yeah, this is a really short floor with two boss fights in this. It's still pretty short and pathetic. I didn't hit him with that. Let's try to get another gimmick code out of this. I missed him because it went down. There's the beginning of my folder. And I'm... I couldn't get another combo in. I need to hit something to be able to combo off it. That works for me. Oh, so close. Really, I could have finished it on that last combo. <laughs> but sadly, he moved. But anyway, we win. And we get Jiffa. And level 11 could power increase. That takes care of that. Yep, Jasmine saved and we got back to them too. Hey that and do you still have don't you still have one wish left? He sure does. Time for me to make this prin the prince out of this guy. Of course I'd like to be free, but there's all but like we always say, genies can't be choosers. We'll prob you'd probably be miffed that the whole puppet out of the thing anyway. Go on now, wish for what's really in your heart and be a prince. Get the girl. Okay, here goes. I wish for Genie's freedom. And by getting his freedom, he gained things. But how? No one like Jafar can use your evil ever again, Genie. You're free. Ow! I'll never forget this. But what about Jasmine? What are you gonna do? I was wrong, Genie. If I used your help to win Jasmine, I'd be no better than Jafar. Jasmine means the world to me. I want to show her the real me. That's the spirit. Thanks, war, and good luck. I missed what he said. Sorry, I was reading the text. Uh, I, was <laughs> I was reading that, actually. That's when it hit me. You must be looking for someone you care about, too. Yeah. Listen, Genie. Say no more, little pal. I know just what you're thinking. Here you go, Sora. Uh, 
Whenever you need me, just call. If that's okay with you, Al. Of course. Are you sure? Anytime at all. Hey, whenever you guys... Hey, without you guys, I might never have been able to ditch the lamp. And I think of that and would be fine on his own. Wow, thanks a lot. Let's hope both our wishes come true then. Take care, Sora. We obtained Genie, and that is it. That is the end of this world. That it was it's actually was like what fifteen minutes is shorter than the last one. I don't exactly remember how long World One was, but yes, that's it. So let's save level eleven. Let's just like. Yeah, during level one up last time, I accidentally hit slate, so it's evened it out by hitting both slates. So, what's going to do that? One. Oh, wait, what? I forgot. I forgot, Genie counts as a magic. And... So that... Bloody hell. Shit. Be it for the world and back room. Characters, we are not new characters. Axel, a mysterious figure who stands in Sword's path. Oh, it's read half the time Axel seems to be just messing around, but for all we know, he's done more thinking than anyone else put together. Everyone. And that. What other character did I unlock? The Moogles! Because I got it! Oh wait, I think I should make something obvious. If you don't know what movie this world is from, it I'll give you a hint. Yeah, that's about all the hint I can give you. <laughs> if you still haven't figured out, it's Aladdin. There we go. Yeah, there should be one more guy here that we haven't seen, but oh well. That's it. I will see you all next week for World 3 of them, which actually I can show what it will be. Olympus Coliseum. Oh, that's not really going to be a fun floor, but I will see you all then. Good night, and I forgot my line. <laughs> Good night, all.